Hello and welcome to my channel. If you are new here, my name is Claudia Nari and on here we talk about various fragrances that are in my collection or anything that you have recommended that you could be interested in me talking about. This is going to be what am I wearing for March, right? Uh, what am I going to put on? And I have like a little shelf that I put my fragrances on and then this is an opportunity for me to try to wear most of my fragrances and figure out where they fit right should i keep them in my collection should they become bedtime scent do i need to give them to probably some family members right i just want to get an opportunity this year is to use my fragrances i'm trying not to shop don't hold me to that because i am still shopping uh but i'm trying not to so if you are interested in what am i wearing for march in hopes that it would give you some inspiration for what you should pull out in March, then stay tuned. All right, I won't hold you long. Uh, I am going to just tell you about the ones that I am uh, deciding to wear. And what I often do is I come back at the end of the month and I tell you if I paired them together, like say I did layering combo, or how did I layer the fragrances? And I promise you, I am going to come back at the end of the month. I'll make it a priority to tape it. Because for those who like to know what am I wearing for March, they also want to know if I layered them and how did I layer them. So let's just jump in. Uh, is I have them in order of how I think I'm going to wear them. Uh, but there's a possibility it might not be in this order. So let's start off with my very first one. This one here, oh, Perfume de Mali. I mean, God, it's so many of them. I want to say this is um, Marlo, I think. Marlo, I'm Mar I can't think of the name right now, but of course I've written it under the bottom, but I want to say this is Marlo. Um, but anyway, it's at the bottom of the thing. So I'm going to wear this one because this is like an almost like a an airy green freshness. So this is going to make it to the shelf. My next one I'm going to wear is one that is discontinued. And I kind of hate to show you this, uh, but it's one of my favorites. And that is C. Flory. Oh, this is like a, oh, a delicious bubble gum. Oh my God, that's what I think of this. <laughs> this is so good. So this, of course, is making it. I have uh, two, I have three Middle Eastern fragrances. Uh um, and I don't know. I don't know if you can put her in Middle Eastern, but I am. I'm going to put her in Middle Eastern. This is Kaili, Kaili um, Fragrances, and it is Sweet Diamond Pink Pepper. So I'm going to be wearing that in March. My next one is by Tim Avicii, and it is Empyrean. This is so good, right? A lot of times people... Who tried this one said it smelled like Delena. It doesn't. It doesn't. And I um and and, and I'm a, I'm gonna give you a reason why I think that it doesn't smell like Delena. But it's gorgeous. So if you haven't heard of Tamavichi, you need to get into Tamavichi. This one is amazing. You need to get into Tamavichi. Uh, another minute Eastern one is there. This is Latafa's uh, take on uh, roses. What was it called? Ro was it Rose Petal? I don't know, but it was by Tom Ford. <laughs> and I liked this one better. This is like a spicy rose. So this is in hopes that I may go out in March, which I probably will. You know, I have like a dinner date or something like that. And I'm going to go out and I'll wear this one. And I have two other ones that I may consider wearing. This one here, I took out, I'm not even going to lie to you or even tell you that it didn't have anything to do with the fact of the packaging. <laughs> I love the packaging of this one. This is Pink Me Up. This is another one of those nice, classy, almost like peony type fragrance. Oh, this one is gorgeous. The bottle is gorgeous. The fragrance is gorgeous. So that's making it to my shelf. 
and uh, I'm gonna have Delina, of course. You know, you just cannot have March come in, spring come in at any point, and not have Delina. So I have to have Delina, and this is Delina um, exclusive. So this is not the um, this is not the original Delina. This is the more sweet, delicious Delina. Oh, I love this one. I'm gonna have so much fun wearing Delina. I already know that I am. And for my night out on the town, I have um, Tom Ford's Orchid Soule. This one here is so sexy. Oh, God, this one is so sexy. This is absolutely sexy. It's, it's hard to find uh, at a reasonable price, but it is so sexy. And I'm a little nervous because I'm kind of coming down. <laughs> this one is light. Oh, I'm nervous. I'm nervous. So if I end up finishing this one, which I don't know if I will finish it in March, but I may finish it this year. I'm going to have to get a, a, another bottle. I really enjoyed this one. And another one for a night out on the town is going to be Noble 1942. And this is Cypress 1942. This is beautiful. Mm, this is so, it's like, every time I wear this one, people always ask me, what am I wearing? It's so unique. It's in like a lane all by itself. This one is absolutely gorgeous but i will say this it's not for the young at heart this is a woman's like a woman's fragrance you got to be a full-grown woman and wear this one here because you, you have to carry yourself in such a way right you have to walk with some command cypress 1942 is not for like the casual spray i'm gonna run out to the grocery store that is not this this is, I need to have on something really nice, really sophisticated. Uh, you don't even have to be dressed up, but you need to have the look like you're demanding the room. That's this one here. Love it. So those are going to be the nine fragrances that I'm going to wear for the month of March. I am so excited. Uh, mostly I'm excited for the C. Uh, Fleuré, you know, that is one that I, I'm, I'm trying to wear it, but I don't want to wear it uh, too much because it is discontinued. Uh, Pink Me Up is another one that I'm looking forward to wearing. Of course, Delina. Uh, and then uh, that Cypress 1942. But stay tuned because at the end of the month, I will come back and let you know. Um, I don't know if, uh, how I layered them. I can't say that any of these are not going to keep stay in my collection. I think I kind of cheated myself this month because I like to pull out maybe two that I'm thinking about. And I don't have any that I'm thinking about. I liked, I like all nine. So this is going to be about how did I wear them more than if they're going to stay. I hope you stay tuned. And if you have not subscribed yet, please hit the uh, description button, notification, so that you will always know when I put out a video. I'm going to talk to you soon.